Yeah, for the most part, it's as safe as it probably could be. Depends on your definition of safe. Could be safer. I mean, no one really does anything that important. So, like, it's not, it's not, it's not necessarily dangerous, but yeah. Uh, can I don't really care. I just wear the same outfit every day, but switch out the pants and shirts. Um. The dress code, I mean, it's it's all right, but it's poorly enforced. Most people are all right about it, but you know, it could be better for some people. Uh, what do you think about our school's dress code? I didn't know we had one. <laughs> I mean, I've heard of it, but it's not followed, which I think is good. Cause like we're old. I thought it's good. I mean, like. At least they're not wearing like school uniforms or something. That'd be ridiculous. It's all right, I guess. School sports, I could care less about it. <laughs> I think it's overrated and I don't know. No one really cares. <laughs> I don't do them. <laughs> so you don't, you don't really care much about them? Well, here's the thing. I think sports are good. I just wish they had a little bit more variety than like the average like soccer or basketball. Like I wish they had a Zumba class. Like I would take a dance class, anything really. Like, I don't know. Just like something nuanced or with a little more variety. Uh, they're a good way to, for kids to meet people and learn a new skill that would be pretty expensive otherwise. Yeah. Um, I think that they're good for the school and they create unity between uh, students at Bountiful High. I don't think they do a single thing. They're they're not incentive. They're not. I don't know. They're just annoying when you get a U and you're like, ugh, I have to go do the stupid canvas thing. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> it's not fun. <laughs> um. Here's the thing, is I think they should be based on somebody's actual behavior and less on their attendance, because if you can still pass the class while not attending, then you're intelligent enough to get and earn a good grade. But like, if you're getting citizenship, that's bad simply because you, like I've had an A and then a U before, and I feel like that's dumb because if I'm like a bad kid, I should get a U, which there's no such thing as a bad kid. It's entirely subjective, but um, like, if people are actually behaving badly in class and like are a distraction, then they should get a U. But if it's like based on attendance, that's so dumb. If you can pass the class without going, then you don't need a U. They don't do anything. Like nothing at all. They might as well not be there. You want to elaborate on that a little? Like, if I get a U, it takes me like 30 minutes to get rid of it. I mean, five dollars. Like, I, and then I get to be late for the rest of the term. Like. If anything, it's a net positive. Um, I feel like for the population we have here in Bountiful, it is pretty diverse. Um, but, I mean, there's always room for more diversity, I feel like. Yeah. Yeah, it's pretty diverse. I think it's not very diverse. I mean, there is more diversity than, like, there has been here in the past. But, like, compared to, like, other states, there's not. But it's, like, we can't just, like, force... For Utah school, yes, I'd say so. Most of the white, most of the population in Utah is predominantly white, and there's a, I feel like there's a good mix of Hispanics, Blacks, Whites. Uh, way better than in France. That's what I have to say. Alrighty. It can be toxic a bit of times. Uh, the. Just the atmosphere, uh, it gets really weird sometimes. Uh, people cussing all the time. Just stuff like that. Um, I mean, I feel like it's just like, bro, everyone's pissing me off, bro. Like, um, like I would say it's negative. It's mid. Um, there's nothing that's. Everybody thinks they're either popular or an outcast, so there's not really an in-between. Okay, so for real though, I just think that we we need to learn more about what we can and can't say no to within our schools. I don't like it here. <laughs> Get me out. <laughs> Ever since I got here, I knew I hated this place. 
so I will not be coming back ever. Um, quite frankly, I'm not really sure there's anything the administration can do about it, but like, I think most people are nice. I just think you have to learn how to communicate with this group of people because it's a very specific group of people because Bountiful is sort of in its own bubble. So like, you need to learn how to talk in a way that will make people like you. But if you, I wouldn't say that there's very much variety in the people here. You know what I mean? I feel like everybody sort of thinks the same and does the same thing. At least that's what they all sort of project. But I guarantee you that underneath everybody's got their own deal going. Um, I feel, at least the people I hang around, I feel like it's pretty good. There's, people are nice. You can, there's like this stereotype around high school that's like, oh, you have to be really careful with everyone's watching you. And I haven't found that to be the case. I feel like everyone is pretty, in general, pretty kind to each other. And it's a pretty calm and uh, chill atmosphere, I feel like. Uh, the atmosphere is... It's it's all right. I mean, I I not really for it or against it. It's just there. You know, I think we could use some more mutual respect and care for each other. Pretty good. A lot of friends, good teachers. Not to mention our pretty good principal. I'd say this is actually pretty better than any other school there is. It's pretty chill, till it isn't. Uh, especially this year, I don't think we have a very um, good school spirit, so 